Keep on watching if you want to see how I went from this to this. Hey guys, welcome to my channel. Welcome back to my channel. So today we're trying the Chloe Ting two week show challenge and this has been absolutely everywhere and I was like okay it's time for me to try it and usually I'll say I'm super excited about trying something new but today not so much I am actually yet. I am so unfit I have not worked out in so long but before we do anything make sure to like and subscribe down below and let's get on into the video Part. I now have to measure myself don't really want to do it but here we go so my waist is 32 inches and now I'm just gonna change my shorts so I can actually measure like my hips and this feel like it's gonna be a little bit difficult and 37 inches around my hips now that's done let's start the two-week challenge and I'll come back at the end of the video and show you guys my results let's go so here I am working out thinking I am amazing for doing 10 minutes of abs I actually found out that is only part of the full workout everyone's lining up to see there must be something bad See you walking down the boulevard She got the posture of a superstar She looks so fly in those Gucci This is going to be a long two weeks and I don't know what I've gotten myself in for Oh my god I'm done, I'm not doing any more this <sighs> Don't suggest wearing bed socks and like the biggest pants that I own. I honestly am really hot and sweaty right now. Goodbye and I'll see you tomorrow. She love how I'm rocking it. Betty's a love of my rocket ship. And she called me Zaddy and she got a fatty and she's so provocative. I'm torn. I'm so sweaty and so tired. But I've literally only done the first part of the workout. And now it's 10 minutes of abs. And I just. Oh my god. You texted me so sexually. I swear I got that recipe. I was so hard. My stomach hurt so badly. Oh my god, I won't do this. Okay, bye guys. So I just took some pre-workout and I'm feeling today's workout at the moment. So hopefully this momentum actually carries throughout the workout. But let's do this. Will you should be fair? That's when she said, I just want to know what's on your mind. Is it real or it's all a waste of time? I don't really want to blow the high. I want to know if I can make you stay this time. I just want to know what's on your mind. Is it real or it's all a waste of time? I don't really want to blow I have one more 
thing left to do yet. It's freaking abs. But like, oh my god. I need to just like pump this out and then I'm done. Let's do this before I actually pass out. Oh my god. Me and Vicky Sticks. Chillin' then we downtown, made a couple beats. I'm literally just so exhausted and so sweaty. Like, I don't know if you can tell how red I am right now. Okay, see, I'm just gonna like go pass out now. <sighs> So I just wanted to come on and say it might seem like I'm half assing it, but I, I physically can't do a push up or those plank dips. So I think it's better that I do an exercise that I can actually do and still be doing some sort of exercise than me falling down every like five seconds and I'm really not doing anything when I if I'm doing that. So that's why I'm doing it. I'm actually probably working myself harder than if I was to do a push up or those plank dips because I honestly would just like, I either would give up on it or it would just, I would really not be doing anything if I'm honest. So I'll get back to the workout now. Loki, that was a quick break <laughs> for me to catch my breath. Honestly guys, I wasn't really feeling like working out today. Obviously, I'm here, I still did it, but I just don't feel like I probably put as much effort in as I did, like, let's say yesterday. Because like yesterday, I feel like I kind of killed it. And then today, I just, I just don't feel like I put as much effort in. Like I still am like puffed out, like sweating everywhere. But I still don't feel like I put as much effort in as I did yesterday. I don't know if it's because I'm just like a bit sore and a bit tired. So I'll see you guys in the next workout and hopefully have a little bit more like oomph. Ugh. I've been feeling so, I've been feeling so down, yeah Can you tell me why, can you tell me why I'm down, yeah No friends of mine, no friends of mine around, yeah Now I'm thinking now, now I'm thinking now Might have caught the June blues, yeah, I wanna so One more workout left to go today and it's the ab one, like the 10 minute abs And I'm just... Exhausted. Only fucking you now when I drive around on feeling. I actually feel like vomiting right now. Oh my god. Oh my god, my stomach. I actually like feel like I'm about to vomit. So my dogs are like barking their head off right now, so I'm gonna go try not to vomit. And I'll see you in the next workout. Hopefully, I'm feeling better. Hit you up half past nine. Say, let's go for a ride. City lights in the sky. Top down, close my eyes. We got no place to be. Driving around aimlessly. Thinking about the past and now. Leave the stress, let's clear the clouds This to my left, this to my right In fear, peak, getting lost for the night No more bottles left to go around It's gonna stay now, shout out to the real ones This to my left, this to my right In fear, peak, getting lost for the night No more bottles left to go around It's gonna stay now, shout out to the real ones That was hard when you have four workouts in one day And they're all like pretty intense I would say it kills you. 
She love how I'm rocking it. Hey guys, so I basically just wanted to quickly come on and say that I am in a bit of pain from yesterday. Just my arms, my abs a little bit, but I've mainly noticed my arms today were quite sore. So I just thought I'd quickly come on and let you guys know that. I also got my brows done and my nails done today. So feeling fresh. Thank you, that's disgusting. And I'm now going to go work out on tape break. You got the puppy don't you know, pump it up. I don't know ya, but I can see the signs. I can show ya, or I can make you mine. I need your love, cause it gets me high. I need your love, it's got me mesmerized. Your love, your love, mesmerized. Your love. I'm gonna quickly come on here and show you how much I'm sweating. Wait. It's like dripping literally everywhere. I don't know if I've sweat this much in my entire life. Oh my god. She think that I'm Hollywood. She know that she got a good angel boy. Never gonna stand a chance. Heartbreak like a sad romance. Said that you never come back again. Been three days on your back again, but I'm not your man. I literally have the fan on. I'm wearing like nothing compared to the other workout. And I'm still sweating like a pig. So. Get me to stay Cause I've been around for three days But I gotta go before we let it get too close to Friday Cause I gotta hit the highway I don't wanna make you cry, babe But I ain't coming back now Fade into the background I still wanna be there I got to be leaving Will you should be fair That's when Just finished the workout then And I wanted to quickly come on and say that I've actually noticed a difference in the strength of my arms like with the up and down planks I can actually do them a lot better now and I've noticed like just a huge difference with that and some of the other exercises I'm just more confident while doing them and I feel like stronger and more able to do them I got that recipe, make your body rest in peace. baby I'ma do you right Just watching the sweat drip down from my forehead. One, two, three. Cause it gets me high. I it's got me. Two more days left to go. I just wanna go to an island. I'll be sipping on some nice tea. Take me away to an island. Wanna feel the Maui breeze Maybe I can go to Paris Save on shore to the Arc de Triomphe Or maybe I can go to Ibiza And dance till the sun comes out Okay guys, that's the workout done and I think that was one of my like best workouts. I had like rarely any breaks besides like the little rest breaks in the workout but like usually I'll stop the video and like literally sometimes just lie on the ground dead. So I didn't do that today which was a very good sign and again just feeling very able to do lots of the exercises more than usual and not getting as tired and I'll see you in tomorrow's workout which is the final workout. Alrighty, goodbye. Oh, Never gonna stand a chance Heartbreak like a sad romance Said that you never come back again Been three days, now you're back again But I'm not your man, no I'm not your man I can blow your mind like whoa Why be faithful when you got hoes? So yesterday I finished the 14 day challenge And now it's the next morning And I'm gonna measure myself And see if I've noticed a difference So from this I have lost One inch of 
this is the waist area i think it's the waist area but i have lost one inch off of this i just changed into some other shorts so i can measure this properly okay and this part here which i think is the hip area that was 35 inches and i honestly cannot remember what it was at the start i think the main difference i noticed anyway was around here i did weigh myself at the start of this challenge and i did weigh myself this morning i'm not going to put my weight up on the screen but i didn't really notice a difference anyway it wasn't significant enough for me to be like oh yeah i lost like two kilos doing this so the reason i don't think there was much change on the scale was i think i've actually gained muscle and in saying that i'm now going to get on to my final thoughts so let's go Alrighty, so my final thoughts on the Chloe Ting's two week shred challenge is this is a challenge. She was not joking around when she was calling this a challenge. It is hard. Like, I don't know if this was because I was really unfit. I really don't know, but if you're just starting out or you haven't done exercise in a while, you probably will struggle. I now understand why Chloe Tings has these amazing abs because her workouts are hard and they are intense. And <sighs> even though this was super hard, I did find it worth it at the end of it because I've actually noticed a difference. So basically from my measurements, I'd lost an inch off my waist and then I ended up losing two inches off my hips, which I'm not even sure if I measured right because I'm shook that it was two inches off my hips. I feel like that's like low key a lot. I also mentioned a few times throughout the video, I noticed a huge difference with my strength and my ability to do the exercises. Also, I've noticed a difference in my body just being more toned. Even my mum has said that I'm looking a bit more toned as well, especially in my stomach. They are just like so much harder. Like I'm literally going up to like my boyfriend, like feel, can you feel it? Like two weeks is not a long time and I honestly saw like such big improvements. I do want to emphasize though, this is hard like you would want to have seen results after what you did because like like I almost vomited there was times where I was just lying on the ground very rarely am I dripping sweat from my forehead like literally can flick off sweat it was hard but I do believe it was worth it okay enough talking make sure to like and subscribe and I'll see you next Sunday bye